I wonder if this Starman is the same Starman David Bowie sang about on Ziggy Stardust. I like Ziggy Stardust. Bowie had green hair on that album. No Earth scientist is safe from the Sumerians. Tonight, Professor Ishii carries some of the defense plans home for study. Isako and Harada are returning home from a neighbor's birthday party. Detective Taragawa, before investigating further, must seek medical help for the stricken Professor Ishii. The detective sees what appears to be a private hospital. to see me? I'm a police officer. There's a man who's been hurt on the next corner. The man needs medical aid. But this is a private hospital. I know that, yet you can't let him suffer That's there. True. Oh, I overheard. Send an ambulance for the man immediately. He'll be treated very well. You're a policeman, eh? Looking for mutants? Yes. Uh, I trust you'll be successful. I wish you luck. Thank you, Doctor. Now, if you'll excuse me. By all means. This is no real doctor. This is a Zamarian mutant. They acted strangely. We should investigate. Not me. And you know that Father warned us not to stay out late, so let's get on. You're afraid. I'm not. I'm going to become a detective in a few years, so I'll learn how tonight. Stop it. You're being silly. <gasps> now, why are you children out so late? That's a big secret. Why do you ask that? You see. Here, look at my identification cards. You mean you're a detective, then? Thank you. 
That's right, children. Have you seen anything suspicious tonight? There were two men acting very strangely. Oh? What did they look like? They were wearing light coats and carrying some kind of case. desperately to seek one formula which will stop the mutants from dividing and another formula which will destroy Balazar's brain when it is located. Time is running out for the planet Earth. Inspector, I'm still suspicious of that hospital. Mm. You know, at first I thought you were wasting your time investigating the hospital, but I don't know now. You don't, sir? No, I find it strange that Professor Ishii died there. They could have saved him. Yes. I would like you to keep the hospital under surveillance. Yet they mustn't know that you're doing this. This might turn out to be one of their headquarters. I'd like a report whenever you learn anything. The two Zimmerians who attacked Professor Ishii realized they must get rid of the only humans able to identify them, the children Isado and Harada. Oh, your shoelace is untied. I'll fix it. A child is here. He's been hurt. Oh, show him in. Come in here, Isako. Now, go ahead. It's all right. 
no. What's the matter, Sasha? It doesn't hardly touch me at all. That's mm. true, Doctor. But he should remain for examination, don't you think so? Mm. He wouldn't like to have an infection. Definitely not. Let me take a look. Mom! Hmm? <laughs> well, put him in one of the rooms. It's no use. I won't go in. Oh, oh behave and don't be afraid. I think you'll be all right now. <laughs> yes. I'm certain he'll be a good boy. Tell me, you won't mind staying for observation. Then you can leave tomorrow if you're well. Oh. <laughs> You'll see, Sasha. You won't mind this at all, Isako. Hmm? Ah. Isn't this nice? Sleep here. Can I lie down? Of course, if you like. If you feel like a nap, you can take it. I'll come back later. Behave. Take care of him. He's my only brother. We will. I'll come by tomorrow to take you home. Don't forget. Come along. Don't be worried. Your brother's in good hands. I still don't like it here at all. I'll escape as soon as I can. Rid of him. <laughs> <laughs> 